the joke of my life that I'm hearing like from almost every person I oh. meet is like oh my god I'm seeing double that's so yeah. funny how many times could I hear it maybe a hundred yeah she's older she's 10 minutes older mm. and and uh, <clears throat> when people just meet us nobody can believe I'm older uh, because I'm uh, shorter she's a nice person sometimes uh, but not to me obviously I would describe her as a very pleasant person to be around when she's not your sister I would describe her as um, stubborn uh, independent uh, gentle uh, reliable and uh, open. I, I always keep her in mind, I always keep in mind the thought that uh, there is the second person that I'm in a way responsible for. Having a twin is um, it's just a thing you have to adjust yourself to. Having a twin is a style of my life. <laughs> well, I think a lot of people in the, the university think we are the same person because sometimes on the streets some random people just greet me and I don't even know who they are. So I, I just greet them back because I thought if I were my sister they would think I'm impolite. When we were in high school our classmates uh, didn't even try to tell us apart and to not to memorize our names but to associate each of us with our names. They would just call us sister or a twin sister, which was the most offensive name that we could ever get. <laughs> but I don't get offended when people uh, confuse us. I just get sad. Yeah, it just reminds us uh, how similar we are. I met first Nastya and she was, I don't know, smiley and funny, I don't know. I met them uh, online. At first, uh, before I came to UBG, uh, we decided we, uh, that uh, we would be roommates. First I met Nastya, it was during the uh, orientation week. I kind of found them like very similar and it was kind of hard to distinguish them. They have different uh, hairstyles uh, and they have different faces and they have different voices and different personalities. I guess it was Nastya, she had a French, like different hairstyle and like this is what, this is how I distinguish them. Like, for the first time. I don't understand why people cannot distinguish them because they are so different. I mean, if not even, they are two different persons, they have two different personalities. The faces are really different and kind of very simple to, like, you know, this is Nastya, this is you, then it's strange for me now how people like, can, can say who is who. Uh, now there are a few people who don't even know me but don't know my sister and they don't even know that I have a sister, mm -hmm. so they treat me like a normal person, the way I want to be treated. And yes, and the people who know only about the existence of one of us, they are so special that they don't even consider us um, sisters, and that's something unusual. I don't know how it happened, but in our childhood, almost all our friends were twins, and. I guess it wasn't that such a rare thing back in 90s. I didn't realize it was something special about them or us. Yes, because we always um, viewed them as sisters but not as twins. Mm -hmm. We saw that they are very much alike and I couldn't even tell them apart but still. And we would always divide them and I would be friends with one of them and you know with another. Yes, we live in, in the same room so um, physically, we are always uh, by each other's side, but not in our minds, <laughs> at least. <laughs> I talk to my other roommates much more often, yeah. We shared everything, yeah. and that's what made us annoyed by each other so much. She was always around, and we were sitting at the same desk at school, yeah. and we had one textbook for the two of but us. It's it's common sense, it's cheaper this way. Yeah, that's why we can't um, live in different rooms because we have one teapot. <laughs> <laughs> it's not even 
um, about the common things, but I just feel uh, the most comfortable um, living with Nastya than with somebody else because you can imagine uh, living with yourself and so it feels the same with us living with each other. Maybe it's not that bad having a twin if you are separated. Uh, if you, maybe it, it can even be a good thing when you have you know, different things to go to and you go to different schools, then you would uh, be able to share all those things with your sister and maybe it would be nice, but we never had this chance. Yes, we try to separate activities and hobbies, but the problem is that we are interested in the same things mm -hmm. because from the childhood our mother didn't really bother to separate <laughs> us in different clubs. I always thought of our achievements as our, you know, com something common. I considered my victory or my failure only in comparison with Nastya and um, as if all the other competitors didn't exist <laughs> for us. We used to um, to argue with each other and beat each other with different things and then count bruises and whoever had the the bigger amount of bruises lost, I guess. Our mom, she uh, gets offended when she sees us arguing, but we are used to say, so, but you don't know what, what it's like to have a twin, why are you getting offended? Um, when we were little, she was trying to stop and to convince us that we don't have that big of an argument and there is no point in uh, quarreling, but then she just decided that it doesn't work and she just left the room without saying anything, which meant that she is really angry at us. We asked our <coughs> mother how she felt when she found out that she is going to have twins and she, she said that it's not a big deal. I mean, and sh she always saying that uh, she never brought us up because we were so independent. Uh, what they're always telling us that is that being twins is an advantage and they always um, try to treat us like we are uh, so different and I guess they perceive us as different people and they always try to emphasize the differences rather than to um, point out the similarities. A lot of people <laughs> They say, I wish I had a twin, yes. That's so, that must be so nice having a twin. Don't think that it's nice having a twin, because it's not nice. And uh, cherish your <laughs> uniqueness, twin twinlessness. <laughs>